A wrongful death lawsuit testimony continued today in the trial against Kent Hospital and its doctors. Actor James Woods filed the suit claiming his brother Michael did not receive adequate medical care and as a result died at the hospital. Taking the stand, a cardiac specialist. I went to snooze reporter Walt Pateau has been in court all day and he joins us live in Warwick with the courtroom details. James Woods' attorney went after a colorful euphemism used by an expert witness for the defense who spent the morning picking apart a series of points made by two plaintiff's experts. Woods had what we call the Widowmaker. The doctor testified that slang refers to the deadly combination of plaque and clot clogging an artery. By my count, you use the word Widowmaker 20 times. Dr. Hedelman Somebody used that term one more time, testifying that Wood's condition would have been difficult to treat in Kent's ER. If somebody has a Widowmaker obstruction with a clot and they're having a heart attack, their chances of dying are at least 50%. The defense witness countered two plaintiff experts testifying Dr. Kelly Naylor and Kent Hospital met the standard of care while treating Woods. He told the jury the former Warwick mayoral candidate's condition was made worse by his 235-pound weight and half a pack-a-day cigarette habit. When asked if ER patients in Woods' condition die no matter what... Is doomed to die no matter what, are you? Not no matter what. The cross-examination of Dr. Hedelman will continue at a later date. Tomorrow, the plaintiffs pick up their case again with James Woods and the son of the late Michael Woods expected to testify any day now. Live with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom at the Kent County Courthouse in Warwick, Walt Guiteau, Eyewitness News.